Record it in three, two, one. Welcome to another episode of J and Dad's podcast. My name is Clint. My name is Mal. And we back with a very tired and reckless podcast today. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Malcolm. What's up? How was your week, sir? Um, I guess normal. I guess. Normal. Um, normal. normal. Yeah. Uh, gaming. Uh, took the wife out for early Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers. Yeah, Happy Mother's Day for all the mothers. Uh, what else did I do? Except um, my tip and my hundred dollar bills. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I didn't really do anything else, but uh, other than work, like work, work, stream, uh, Mother's Day stuff. Blue collar lifestyle coming yeah. to the theaters near you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say shit though. Uh, allergies beat my ass one good day. Beat the fuck out of me. <laughs> beat the dog shit out of me. But uh, other than that, yeah, work. Did I watch anything? I tried to watch some shit, but that shit failed. Oh, All that shit yeah. failed. Uh. My wife watched like another quarter of the Black Panther movie. She still hasn't watched shit. She still hasn't uh, watched. She low key keeps stopping at the same fucking spot that she, she keeps stopping at. Asleep. No, she ain't falling asleep. She just stopped watching. She's an asshole <laughs> like that. Like she'll just walk the fuck away and you won't come back. Yeah, I was talking. <laughs> I was talking to her uh, earlier because uh, I guess she was playing Doctor Strange for her mom. Yeah. And she was saying that you know she's just not into the whole comic book stuff. Yeah, no. she's like all the characters is pretty much the same. To her. I could some no, nah, I can't make her watch anime, but I have made her watch like Yu Gi Oh and shit. Mm-hmm. So yeah, she won't watch Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, anime is not the question. Even it's full, anime is not the even question. Even Full Metal, and she and I explained to her like twenty thousand times like what the fuck is about, and like that's the type of shit that she likes, and she still won't watch that shit. <laughs> so, <yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, say fuck that shit. Uh, yeah, it's funny you say well, watching it because I just remember <laughs> some stuff I uh, well finished. Uh, uh, Dear white people. And all the season two already. Yeah. How many fucking episodes was that? Uh, like ten. Uh, yeah. yeah. Man, how long? Uh, about thirty minutes oh, yeah, each yeah, episode. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, me and the wife watched that. Uh, finished the whole thing. That that was pretty good. Um, what else do we watch? Oh, I know a while ago we talked on the podcast about the the so called person that created the whole uh, what are those oh, yeah, mean, yeah, mean yeah, yeah. thing? What about that? Did not originate from that person. You know what? You know who really created that? Nope. Fucking Disney. Oh. Wow. we was it was movie night. <laughs> mm. We was watching uh, Hercules, right? Okay. And Hades comes in and he, he looks at dude's feet and he's like, Oh, what a, um, are those? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not that good to talk about. Yeah. That. He was uh, we, on there fighting the mammal with the beard, with the, yeah, the, the hunter head, flops. the hunter head monster and shit like that. His come on and shit. I know exactly what you're talking about. Um, my man had the flip flops on, the Hercules yeah, on his feet. Yeah. And he's okay. like, What <laughs> are those? <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, yeah so that. yeah, that that yeah, person facts. wasn't original. Facts. Uh, it came from it came from Disney. Nineteen ninety six probably. Yeah, nineteen ninety seven or something. Six, seven, five yeah, or something. Nigga. Facts, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> so Disney, Disney, Disney. Uh, Jared, did it first. Podcast will so hit you with the hard facts, nigga. <laughs> I was like, ah, <laughs> I was like, ah, 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 bro, damn. <laughs> I thought that was funny. I was like, ah, oh, so uh, you know what? It did come from that. I was like, man, if you think about it, man, Disney kind of ruined like our lives a little bit because I find myself quoting Disney stuff all the time. Man, I was like, you got no fucking choice. That shit imprints in your fucking head, nigga. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, once uh, this is how you know. This is how you know Disney ruined your life. I was in, I was uh, in the mall, right? So, it was man. crowded as hell. And I was like, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. People were uh, people weren't paying attention. So I was like, please let me through. And then somebody, <laughs> somebody, like two, like four or five people 
Caught on. The Caught on and started cracking up laughing. And I was like, see? I was like, see? That's how I know Disney ruined your life because you knew where it came from. Have you ever been in a Disney store like lately? Like, um, like not, not. Or something like that? Probably like a couple years ago. Um, I've been in a Disney store, but not as of lately, but yeah. like maybe like a year or two. Yeah, ago. like a year or two ago. That's probably the last time I went, but my nigga. If I was a kid and went to Disney store, I couldn't remember. I'm pretty sure I went to Disney. I, went, I know I went to Disneyland for a fact with my OG and my pops. Mm-hmm. But I know for a fact, if I would go to the Disney store like right now, my nigga, I'd probably lose my mind if I was a kid. Oh, man. <laughs> Disney store is expensive. I know it's expensive, but shit, it's so much shit everywhere. Shit, uh, yeah. Like, it's hella shit. I forgot. We had went to one. Where the fuck did we go to one at? Like, a couple years ago. We went to one in, like, Wisconsin or some shit like that. And that motherfucker was nice. Yeah. It was big as shit too. You know, I, I haven't been to a Disney store, but I, I recently, but I bet the last time I've been to one is way before they uh, got the rights mm-hmm. to Marvel. Oh, yeah. So I'm pretty sure that I'm pretty much I'm pretty much sure they probably selling Marvel shit. Oh yeah, they do. They sell so. the little CP three O's. What not CP three O? Uh, what the fuck? The little ball thing called? Oh, uh, BB eight. Yeah, BB eight. Yeah, uh, Star Wars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, so they got them in there. I know that for a fact. Uh, oh yeah, I don't think I did shit this all, week. All, all that's left is the uh, DC. Oh yeah. The DC, uh, oh, Jeff. Oh yeah, you did play that group chat funny as hell. <laughs> yeah, you did play that shit. Mickey with the gauntlet. Oh, oh yeah. The, yeah. The guy, uh, he had yeah. the Infinity oh, yeah, that shit Stones, happened. but it said uh, Star Wars, yeah. Marvel. <laughs> that shit happened though, that shit gonna be lit as fuck though. It's like all that's missing is the DC stone. I started cracking up, man. Yeah, shit gonna be lit. Uh, and what were we saying? Uh, that's the shit that happened this week, bro. Uh, yeah, that was, that was pretty much. I finished uh, season two of My Academia, so I gotta catch up on three now. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You ain't that far behind. Yeah. It's only, it's Malcolm, only been like five. Malcolm broke a little detail to me that I forgot that I didn't catch that. <laughs> Stain is actually dead. <laughs> I thought the nigga just got pierced through the ribs or some shit. That nigga is dead. My nigga, my nigga did one of those. Uh, I man, I forgot the the name of that uh, Japanese warrior who uh, like basically died standing uh, up. Uh, he did one of those. Uh, I thought you were talking about the from the Keanu Reeves movie. Nah, nah, name nah, was, uh, not that for some shit. <laughs> you ain't like that? Uh, Forty seven Ronin or Thirty Six uh, Ronin or some shit like that? I, I don't know why I was thinking about not not him. Uh, well, I didn't really watch Forty Seven Ronin. Yeah, I thought that I was, was dope. For some reason, I thought you was talking about um, not Keanu Reeves, but uh, fucking Jerry Little. No, was it Tom? No, it wasn't Tom Cruise. Was it Tom Cruise? Mm-hmm. Oh, fuck that. Uh, <laughs> Last Samurai. The Last Samurai. Yeah. I have no clue. If I think it was. Was it Tom? Nineties movie. I probably missed that. No, it's not. It's not nineties movie. It was like a two, in the two thousand era. Uh, um, I probably missed that joint. Yeah, how you gonna play? Yeah, it was Tom Cruise. How you gonna play the last? How you gonna be the call of the last samurai shit? And you fucking, well, fucking uh, gaijin, fucking foreigner. Yeah, but uh, yeah, I don't think I did shit this week. I can think of. I don't know. I just barbecued my ass off though. Mm. Yeah, you did. Uh, for Mother's Day and shit. That was fun. Uh, oh, I still got a whole time for that motherfucker. Uh, think about it. Mm. <laughs> <Salmon>. <laughs> uh, yeah, that shit happened to work. Watch that shit. Still ain't playing the game because I ain't got shit to play. Hey, uh, I'm really eventually done. But, uh, um, welcome to uh, God of War because <laughs> I haven't finished it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a, um, well, I still gotta, I still gotta finish like off to that boundary. Would you like to review it right fast? Like, uh, like a quick review? Like, on a scale from 0 to 10? I mean, it... Uh, Do you give it a 10 out of 10 like everybody else? Uh, Do you see flaws? I know you're a Kratos lover. But, yeah, yeah, I, 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 do like, flaws. I do like Kratos, <laughs> but, you know... Mm. It's a lot of 10 out of 10s out of my book. Like, yeah, I would say... It, it oh, is shit. it is a good game. It does have a great storyline. Uh, but it, it, my only gripe was that it was like short, kind of. Like yeah. The storyline itself was like short. Yeah. Granted, that it's probably, um, well, it was like maybe like four, maybe four or five worlds that's on there that we haven't 
been able to go through yet. Mm -hmm. So I'm guessing they're waiting for DLC stuff. Uh, DLC uh, stuff, yeah. So, but other other than that, um, uh, I guess I would say maybe nine point five. Nine point five. Nine. Or nine. Okay. Uh, I mean, okay. It, it is worth. It is worthy of a ten. It is. It is worthy of a ten. But I'm just gonna be a little stickler. <laughs> um, stickler for a stickler. Yeah, for it. But uh, story, storyline, story was beautiful. Everything was beautiful. No glitches. Just no falling through the map. No, no, no glitches. <laughs> no glitches. Um. Uh, other than I would say other than wanting like more than the, like how they left me uh, how I, they, I how heard they like me. like it's like it's a continuous story correct like that's how it ended like it's yeah it's, it's a continuous story. story yeah that's what I was saying the way it left it that's why I gave it like a 9.5 okay, okay. or whatever but yeah, yeah. but I can understand why they left it there what was the last night war uh, before this one what was the last yeah, one? Uh, the last one was God of War 3. I'm saying how long ago was it though? Like uh, some years. Yeah. yeah I heard, y'all heard of people. Heard it here first. Wait, those, that deep rough years to yeah, God of War was, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it was, it, was, it was that long. But this one was Too well, hard, like, too. it was well worth uh, like a wait of them like even uh, doing it. So. Yeah, they, they didn't make that shit like uh, Infinity War. That shit didn't get filmed along with the first one. Uh, 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 it's from scratch again. <laughs> nah, yeah, like it's a whole new like development team and all that stuff. Like for this new one. Um, so and they ain't even the same shit. people. Yeah, for the first shit. six. Uh, oh yeah, I think that's it. Good. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Play top it. picos. Let's get to some top picos. Uh, Malcolm. That's it. So I got some jokes for this one. Uh, Do you care about the Met Gala that happened this week? Do I care about the Met Gala? Yeah. Yeah. I. I mean, I didn't. I didn't watch it or and nothing like that. I don't really. Yeah. 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 Would you like was to see some interesting uh, pictures? You know, this is when the really, really famous people. Uh, what the fuck is the Met Gala for? Do you know? Uh, I don't know what, uh, what it is. Or I'm like, not like yeah, I'm not okay. all that into fashion like that, so okay, cool. I really don't. Well, the thing was about. Catholic something. Catholic something. Yeah. <laughs> That's, I'm Thank pretty you. sure Jay was probably the youngest boy there, so nobody got touched. Hmm. But <laughs> <not the best>. <laughs> <laughs> I got my you missed it. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, yeah. So um. So Jaden showed up. I'm looking for his fucking picture. He showed up with his uh, gold plaque. Either gold or platinum plaque, plaque for Icar. Mm-hmm. I don't know what the fuck is that. Ah, damn, it's like the right picture. Uh, Chadwick Boseman was also there. Oh, here you go. <laughs> he got the altar fist. Like, I wish the motherfucker would say, we'll come down. I dare you. <laughs> <laughs> Cardi B, I don't know what the fuck that is on her fucking head, my nigga. She looks like, uh, uh, little coming to America. She, she yeah, 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 definitely. <laughs> uh, anyway, she had the little Pope joint, but with the rainbows on it. Yeah. Uh, for the LGBTQ. Uh, Diddy had, like, like the whitest white, my nigga. The whitest white? Like, the whitest white I've ever seen in my life, nigga. Like, my nigga, he could've Straight just, from the crown box, He could've been see through, bro. And it was white. Uh, you said he could have been see through. Yeah, and it was albino white. White, white. I ain't gonna have uh, Jaden Smith. Got his little plaque and shit with him. Yeah, this shit happened, man. I still look, he don't know what the fuck the. Is that Tom Holland? No, it's not Tom Holland. I don't know what the fuck that is. Uh, but yeah, I don't know what the fuck the Met Gala is. I know it's like 30,000 like to get in or for a seat or some shit like that. Mm hmm. So, yeah. Uh, yeah I just think it's one of those like. Can you hear me have like some wings? wings. Like real angel wings and shit. Yeah, wings. Oh, here you go. Damn, mm -hmm. motherfuckers look like they flex. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, she was super extra. Uh, somebody else had something else on. I think. And you said the name was. Uh, it was Catholic something. Catholic. I don't know. I don't know. Or, 
it was Catholic something. It was like more to it, but it's Catholic, some other words and shit. I don't fucking know there. But yeah, uh, I was just laughing at Chadwick Bolt when he had his fist balled up like, like a little alternate and shit. <laughs> I thought that shit was funny as fuck. Like, I wish the motherfucker was that kind of forever. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, next topic. Something else that happened this week. No, I will ask you this. No homo. Even though this isn't a homo question, really. But, uh, as a matter of fact, I'm not going to get into your personal love life and everything like that. My personal love life. Do you eat the box? Uh, I know where this is going. <laughs> I know exactly where this is going. I got an ask. From, um, it's because your boy, well, what your boy said. Oh, DJ Cut? That ain't my nigga. I'll tell you the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's funny? Man, when I, I instantly thought about his old interview. Uh, I was wondering as, what the fuck um, DJ Kelly's ever not wearing the meal. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Fuck if he missed the meal. He said he turned he, down some fucking food. <laughs> <laughs> Tell him he don't do something. <laughs> oh, I, you know what? I instantly thought about like how remember like how high school how every mug would like deny it oh yeah but then like in college people was like kind of proud of doing it all times stuff yeah <laughs> yeah yeah it, I, I just found it funny so i i i, I took it as dj cali is still in his high school phase i don't think it's the fact that motherfucker said he don't like eat, eat the box it was just the way that it was, was the way explaining it explaining yeah. shit. that nigga said i'm a king i don't go down on my queen she go down she, on me he, though yeah, like, but y'all, yeah, you don't return favors. Yeah, it's yeah, like, uh, nah, nah. Man, I don't do that shit. Kings don't get down on their knees. Women get down on their knees. This started a big ass yeah. debate. About, uh, I think like the Rock got into this shit or some shit like that. Yeah, or something like that. Like, yeah, the Rock had a comment. I think Ti did too. too. I think Ti did too. I'm not sure. I can't remember. Yeah, that was the whole uh, debate Spiel. this week. Yeah, <laughs> DJ Khaled not eating the box. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> News, 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 huh? Hey, <laughs> hey, you gotta be fair. You gotta be fair, man. DJ Kelly don't believe the equal rights. Yeah, yeah, apparently so. Women shouldn't vote. <laughs> <laughs> D, D, DJ Kelly in the 19s, uh, 19, 1950s. Real, uh, real early 1900s. He said he, he, want, he wants you to, uh, as soon as he get home, he wants you to hand him a martini glass. Women stay home and cook. <laughs> I was like, Work. all right. Man, you tripping, man. Salary. That'll make me a salad. <laughs> 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 but yeah, so that was DJ Khaled. I don't know what to say about that shit. Uh, <laughs> Malcolm, uh, I, I swore that we wasn't going to talk about this dude no more, but we have to just because he's probably the only nigga that you would probably recognize if I started naming names and shit like that. Okay. Uh, so R. Kelly, uh -huh. XXX Tentacion. Uh -huh. Um, oh, somebody uh, else and another rapper. I don't know. Uh, do you know S S S Tentacion though? Mm, and no. That name, no, I don't know, yeah. but I heard that name heard mentioned that because yeah. of the Spotify. Yeah. Spotify. Okay. Yeah. So Spotify. Now that you said Spotify, they are t they well. The thing that is weird because okay, they stopped featuring these artists because of their sexual misconduct, and sexual well, assault. Well, shits. they they're still on there. Exactly. But. They're not. Um, They're not like recommending, recommendation type. Yeah, shit. Like, like some of, some of their like stuff is on that type shit. Like, yeah. yeah. So you actually gotta search them out and search for their fucking names and shit. Yeah, cause like Spotify is trying to be like you know trying to distance themselves. Yeah, they're trying to mute R. Kelly shit and then they try to also yeah. get rid of the sexual assault and all this. Other yeah, cause shit they got like this like whole. Uh, There's so fucking many now in days. Yeah, cause they got like this whole I want to say um, rubric of like. Uh, they terms of like service and all that stuff. Yeah. And, uh, for spot. Uh, so you know, cause like all these different companies and stuff, you know, people people feel a certain way about you know either uh, either the company like go left or right or, yeah, yeah, yeah. or some shit, and like people be like, well, you need to do something about such and such, yeah. and they so Spotify uh, answer to that is like. Well, my you, whole thing is like, my nigga, y'all didn't low key do shit. 
because they still on your fucking platform. Like all yeah, I have to do is search, all I have to do is just search the name. Yeah, like, yeah, it's it's only certain. They like, gonna take the whole R. Kelly playlist then. Like that don't even make no fucking sense. Like, like if y'all yeah. don't take a stand, take a stand, take the nigga off the whole motherfucking thing. Yeah, because like, like it's, that it's, it's, that's stupid as fuck. It's, <laughs> it's certain artists. I would say that it affect more than others. Cause like, yeah. all right, for like a R. Kelly, for exa- uh, example, R. Kelly been out there for a long time, so he got a lot of songs. So like, if Spotify take maybe like half of his shit off of them, mm-hmm. he have like only a few songs. Yeah. So that people would see or li- be able to listen to, right? right. Versus like some of these new uh, people, like that, ex- yeah, yeah, like they only have like either like one album albums, or two yeah. albums, or right, right, so they don't really have that much. That was some, that's another artist, too, but I can't remember who the fuck it was, but it's like motherfuckers pretty much with like sexual assault cases and shit going on, yeah, because like, because in their little terms or whatever, they was talking about anything, like, because basically, they terms were like, if um, any music or blah 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 has this in it, but. A lot of music has all that shit in it, so people they were saying more so like outside if uh, these people have uh, certain things dealing with certain things outside of the whole uh, I guess the era well, of the song and stuff like that. Good to see sexual assault is being halted, but yeah, drug dealers and murders are still accepted. This is America. Next, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I kind of want to recap because we had did a reaction. To this is America. Yeah. And I tried Oof. so many times to fucking upload the shit and we kept getting banged. So I'm just done like doing that shit for music videos now because every time we do one, we get banged for it. I don't know if we got, ain't got enough juice, what the fuck the case is, but uh, fuck you guys with the music videos. Hey, you should play it backwards. Maybe. <laughs> See, it. See, it. See if it'll work. Uh, backwards. Well, yeah. Um, I just want to talk. I don't, I don't want to talk too deep into the video because we talked about it a little bit to the reaction because that was our first reaction. But now it's been a week. Uh, the, re- the video released last Sunday, so it's yeah, it's been out in like exactly a week, and mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure now if I refresh YouTube, it's like a hundred million views now. Yeah. Um, have you looked at any of the, the, the I guess I don't, I, don't, I guess uh, theories, theories or and stuff shit like, like that. that, and like explanations um, from other people and like yeah, because like I I was curious like after the time we watched it, um, I had my own. Because um, we knew when we watched, like, everything that was happening meant something. Yeah. Like, we just don't look that far into the fucking, fucking detail details to see. Like, we're not the researchers. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, like, I... I watch the researchers, and then I go make my own opinion off what the fuck they just said and shit like that after they just said some shit. Right. Like, some some of the stuff um, that people mentioned, I was like, okay, I got that, got that. And I was like, oh... Missed that, but I kind of figured that was a thing. Yeah, cause I was just listening to Dead End Hip Hop last night, and they was talking about the video, and uh, when the screen goes black, and he's like, I, I don't know if it goes black, but when he before he gets on top of the car, mm-hmm. they said it's a noose hanging from the ceiling before he gets on top of the car, some shit like that. Uh, I must have missed that. Yeah, I, I don't remember seeing the noose. Yeah, they said it was a noose up there. I was like, all oh, right, that's uh, some shit. Like, yeah, I know that. like, <laughs> how many times have you watched the video since? Oof, a lot. Yeah, a me lot. too. <laughs> a lot. Uh, this, this, I can this song me, I can like, very heavy to that. Uh, yeah, to that. Million, yeah, right. Hundred million, uh, million views. <laughs> I yeah, can chew a real. whole lot to that shit. Yeah, because uh, I think that's gonna be my ring song for the next yeah. couple months. Yeah. Sorry, X Man. Uh, but uh, <laughs> one of the ones I saw was, uh, okay, I, I knew the pants. I was going to say, like, when we were watching it, I was like, uh, that look like some slave type of pants or whatever. Yeah. Because, like, like, you see it so much in, like, movies yeah, and stuff. Like, like, it's uh, confederate, confederate uh, army pants. Army, as well, yeah, like yeah, confederate pants. So I was like, oh, man. I, like, then went from that to, like, the stance you did was, like, a, a Jim Crow. Like a uh, poster type shit. Yeah, one of those uh, uh, racist ass like uh, ads, posters, ads, or posters, whatever or whatever, it. like caricature. Yeah. yeah. Also, something when um, that we was noticing that and we knew or whatever the fuck cases, but we just didn't pay attention like everybody else did. Like when he shot somebody, every time he shot somebody, the choir or even the dude that was sitting down. Oh yeah, like, I saw that. Was handled like really yeah. gently, but the bites were just dragging. I know the, the stack. Yeah. Yeah, I know the stack because like yeah, that. Yeah, shit. that was. 
talking about like how it, here in America we care more. Did you about uh, did you pick all the credits for off the music? Like it was like I'm pretty sure you don't know half these people, but uh, Young Thug, uh, Black Boy JB, Black, Boy, uh, Black uh, Hold up. Uh, hold on, let me see. Yeah, because there was a lot of ad libs in there. It was like, oh, 21 uh, Savage. Different different songs and stuff. Uh, 21 Savage was on the shit. Uh, what the fuck was I looking for? It's America. One down there. Say, that was like Kanye <laughs> voice in there too. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, um, what the fuck was I looking for? What else? Uh, the. I guess ad libs. Uh, well, we, we mentioned the horse. But it's two different things to the horse. Like uh, somebody said that it was probably like cocaine, like a ride the white horse. That shit. But also somebody was saying like uh, somebody riding death or some shit like that. Like yeah, death like one apocalypse. Yeah. Uh, yeah, from the Bible and shit. Yeah. Um, um, so uh, and then there was also a book okay. too. That All right. Was so it was to that, it was uh, Young Thug, Twenty One Savage, Quavo, Slim Jimmy. Uh, Black Boy JB. So yeah. Okay. The nigga that's saying, show! Yeah, that's true. So, okay. <laughs> um, so yeah, a lot of people that contributed. I'm trying to think what else. Oh, uh, some people also speculated the end, you know, where he's like, right. I hate that people thing. kept saying that, like, he's being chased by white people. Because no, I was that, clearly seeing that black was boy. people in the corner. That was your boy that started that. Yeah. Because yeah. I was uh, saying, cause I see him like, why the fuck do everybody keep thinking all these people I was are like, white? I see and it's clearly it's like clearly a black lady right here right. on this side somewhere. <laughs> it was a black lady. Yeah. Another person. And it was a Hispanic person My, on this side. I never <laughs> looked this way because I'm so focused. Like, why the fuck don't nobody see this black lady right here? <laughs> so like, I, was like, so like, I never even look at this way. But every time somebody said, why the white people are chasing Donald Glover and this means like, get out and all this shit. But y'all don't see this fucking black lady right, right here right on side. like what the fuck bro <laughs> I'm looking dead at this bitch every time I see this fucking video and nobody sees her so yeah but uh but yeah so it was uh, it was a lot of symbolization a lot of people broke the shit down with a lot of theories uh the shit went viral I don't know how much more viral is gonna go with the second week coming around well we already seen I don't know if this is gonna be like I one of those things like alright cool we went viral and on to the next <laughs> kind of like the video was saying yeah but I don't know. I don't know if this is like gonna stand like a. I don't want to say like a test of time or some shit like that. But well, we are. I don't know. Like, is this gonna be like a stamping motherfuckers head? Like, nigga, this is America. Yeah. Like, I really want that shit to be stamped in motherfuckers head. Like, motherfuckers ain't gonna, ain't well, gonna probably do that shit though. Well, it's 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 stamped so hard in there that you know earlier when you know when you was cooking and shit. Yeah. The whole I was like, man, somebody already fucking colonized this the fucking oh, zone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some I white chick like, that made a remix to the fucking this is America. I was like, okay, like, I I'm I'm with we women. Don't care about I'm with white problems. No, I'm like I'm with <laughs> equal rights for women and all that stuff. But it was, like that, was that what she was rapping about? It was the equal rights yeah, for Okay. I didn't know. She was but, white, blonde hair, she remixed this is America. Yeah. That shit was not meant for her. Hey, Right, Whatever like class she had that shit in, she should have kept that outfit in there. So. No, she like <laughs> it, it. It was just like it wasn't this. Like it's not the same artistically. Yeah. Nothing like, yeah, like she like, went to like I, I seen that you showed me when she like she was at a warehouse and shit just like the video and shit like no, yeah man, was like no this is not you no this no. is not for you sorry. Uh, and I'm like I'm like kind of I was kind of pissed because I was like man this shit didn't even breathe this is like yeah. it just came out last week and you already fucking colonized it trying to like yeah. uh. Like, put it for your cause like or whatever. Like I, I'm for it for people for people causes, but like but let this shit about breathe, this bro. Like, like the funny thing is, she own, made it. She made it about, um, shit. but she made it about feminism. And the funny thing is, yeah. this is America isn't isn't even about black people. It's about showing um how America is. Yeah. America is black and white, man and female. Yeah, low key. This low key. is America. Like, low key. Donald Glover <laughs> was put uh, Cal- uh, Childish Gambino in his, in the video. He was America. He was playing America. Like if you yeah. notice, like he was the character America. America. Like so. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah so <laughs> like, that, shit, that shit was dumb as fuck. That old girl even tried to remix that shit or do whatever the fuck she tried to do. That shit. That shit is not noteworthy. You should have left that shit where the fuck it was. At. Yeah, I was like, if you if you trying to do something, do something in that art realm of of that. Like make your own thing. Just because something is hot. And he uh, take it. If Jordan yeah, Lucas and my son didn't remix that shit, leave that shit alone. Because <laughs> my son remixes everything that's pro-black. So leave that shit the fuck alone. <laughs> Pretty much. 
Uh, oh yeah, I just want to revisit that right fast. Yeah, that's it's, man, that's my joint though. It's my, it's my anthem. Oh, yeah, 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 dude. Uh, Malcolm, uh, I forgot what cities and state this was in, but um, this isn't a new law or anything, but it's I'm assuming it's a resolution somehow, some way. Mm-hmm. Uh, I forgot. I want to say Detroit so bad, but I don't know if it's Detroit for sure. But uh, kids are replacing guns with paintball guns. This is how they are resolving their street wars and oh, shit yeah. like that. I want to say it's Detroit, but I'm not sure that it's Detroit. Let me okay. see if I can find the article on the right fact. I just wrote it in the notes. I didn't, uh, what's it called? <laughs> yeah, I just want to know what you thought about that. Yeah. So I'm assuming, like, they're getting rid of, the, well, they, well, they're not getting rid of guns and stuff like that, but they just, like, offer, like, another, uh, like, another, another outlet. Out, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I mean, like, it's like, What's funny is like that you mentioned that because like outlets are still reporting like how much of a uh, I guess how much danger people were in or like uh, it's causing and bystanders are still getting shot. But at the end of the day, it's but like I mean, do you them think, do you, getting shot by the paintball. I kind of think that's bullets. positive. Yeah, at the same yeah. time, I think it's kind of fucked up because I don't have paintball paint comes paint. off of a car. <laughs> so I kind of pissed when I came out. So that the next day. Like, my shit is, like, all the way shot yeah. the fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> Not to mention that. And I that paint dense, off, yeah, dents, dense. breaks glass, paint. So I don't know how I feel about that. Like, of course, like, people aren't dying anymore and shit like that. But still, my nigga, y'all, like, fucking on my property. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, it's, it's, a, it's, it's a... It's a... I don't know if it's like a, a weird tiny. situation or some shit like that. I don't fucking know, <laughs> my nigga, but, like... Um, yeah, I guess it's a teeny, tiny step. It's, it's like, all right... You go from shooting bullets to paint. Paint ball guns. Yeah. I, I guess that's that. That's a graduate step yeah. in the right direction. Somewhere. Some kind well, of how about we just stop shooting? Like, yeah. Do that? I mean, like, I'd be happy with a knife fight if that gun comes down to someone. They like, said <laughs> some money. <laughs> Shit. Like, I was thinking about that. Like, my nigga, if I come outside, like. Uh, nobody died. Anybody you, just, turn, you turn the news on and shit. Oh, zero, zero, zero people killed today. Zero, uh, see, you come outside. Man, what the fuck happened to my car? <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, you want to react off that shit? Go kill some fucking body. Now your shit fucked up. <laughs> like, that's how I thought about that shit. I just thought that was... I mean, it's cool at all, but still, though, my nigga. Like, uh, I mean, I, hey... Hey, dude. Are, are you numb you, to World Star now? Like, like fighting videos too. and shit like that? I I I tend to like say a fight broke out. I, in front of I you tend like, to stay away right from now. nigga vision. Like I'm just saying, say if a fight broke out in front of you right now. Right. Would you sit there and watch, or do you just keep going? Ooh, that's a good question. Because I, I don't know. It 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 depends. Cause like the the nigga in me says, watch this nigga is this cool. is entertaining. <laughs> but then the the grown, uh, the grown adult in me, <laughs> the responsible the person, says, responsible person is like, get the fuck out of there, cause somebody gonna start shooting some. Yeah. So, All right. I just <laughs> asked because uh, I, I think like two weeks ago, maybe a week ago, I'm not sure. I seen a fight like on the street. Like it was like it was a bunch of females or whatever for the case is. Like mm-hmm. the first hot day that we get in the summertime. Sick of the mile. That's what day it was. Today yeah. exact. Uh, they was fighting in the street, and I was going to meet new man at the fucking movie theater. Mm-hmm. Uh. I almost hit the people that I was fighting because they was in my fucking way. That's how much I can care less about their fucking fight. <laughs> and like they were trying to save each other, talking about y'all gonna get hit. I said yes, y'all are. <laughs> Cause I don't give a fuck about what y'all fighting about. The first hot day, you bitches out fighting. Like, that's the first thing that come to mind. Have you ever held a, held a grudge through the winter time, my nigga? I held a grudge. That has to be hard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, you. Have. That has to be hard as fuck. <laughs> yeah. At that point, you might as well just. Yeah. Let let it go. <laughs> yeah, that's how I'm I am to like fights and shit now. Like I don't give two fucks if who's fighting or whatever fuck the case is. Yeah, I love, uh, if it's not me, I don't really it's associate hard. with that. It's nothing. hard for me to get no fuck. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I be trying nigga sometimes, but sometimes it don't work. You say you be trying it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh so let's get to some of these other stories. Those are all the main topics and shit like that. Now we just get random shits now eat. <laughs> uh, My Hero Academia get to Yu-Gi-Oh makeover, so they put My Hero Academia on Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Where? Yeah, mm-hmm. I don't know if they're for sale or somebody was just photoshopping the shit or some shit. But somebody, somebody created them or like they actually. I don't know if I'm gonna put a picture of them right now. I might not even give them to you. 
do it on my computer. I was gonna say, if somebody creating those, that's, that's kind of cool. Yeah, I don't, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know if they like. Really or make. if like the company itself, the company that make Yu Gi Oh cards, making like. That would be lit though. Like cards for My Hero Academia, then. But like, fuck it, that'd be dope. Yeah. Be you see dope. everybody quote, uh, yeah, not quote, uh, cork. They cork statuses and shit like that. Yeah, yeah cool. shit like that. That would be cool. I know, he actually printed these on top. Okay. Oh, he printed them. So he's actually like printed out and like ready to go type shit though. Oh, that was a dope. Yeah. I don't know what the fuck the writing is. It's still too small and shit, but it's on Reddit. Uh, yeah, I don't know what the fuck that shit said. Okay, so he made... It says he made, weakness and effect, but it just says... Um, uh, it just says they are I guess you gotta know there who the, exactly who the fuck they are because it doesn't have their names on here. Like, no, it has their um, names at the top. No, it says Elemental Hero Heat. And then uh, old girl says hero kid and shit like that. Uh, and Froppy says elemental hero arena and shit like that. So they don't have the names. Yeah, they don't have the names. So they don't have the names. But I, but, I mean that's cool. Yeah, I, I still those for you. I would kind of like collect those. Like shout for, out to the person that did that Photoshop job. They did good too. Man. Yeah, that is good. They got some real fucking cars and shit like that. Uh, yeah. I wouldn't mind collecting some of those, like the, just to like read yeah, um, quirk like statuses yeah. and stuff like that. And yeah. uh, something else in the news. Sorry, people, we ran this fuck. You already know that. <laughs> um, Tesla will lock out contracts on Monday unless employees vouch for them. So whatever the fuck Tesla did, they don't want niggas out here snitching on them. <laughs> Oh, they they got that building something. I'm a, is this the lawsuit that we had talked about when we were paying motherfuckers and gift cards? Or uh, but the yep, it sell. is. Yep, it definitely is. Yeah, because we talked about it yep. last. And, yeah, we had talked about that before. So yeah, so they locking motherfuckers out. I just think that's for. It's fucked up. Uh, Since we're talking about Tesla, so we're talking about driving. Talk about uh. Oh, yeah, the uh. Uh, Uber joints. It's an article for that shit, so I don't know what the fuck is that. But yeah, um, Uber has uh, flying helicopter cars. <laughs> yeah, so you can, yeah, my nigga, you can order, you can order a chopper. Yeah, where am I getting dropped off at? <laughs> like, my nigga. Into the nearest hospital. In fact, hold on. Where do you get picked up at? That means I have to meet you. So, like, my nigga, you're not going to, I can't meet you at my house. Well, I, I bet it's probably lit if you. <laughs> Somewhere like in the middle of nowhere, like oh, yeah. in a forest, like you don't eat house in the forest or something like that. That's risky shit though. And yeah. <laughs> it depends on how. Maybe so. I don't know. I don't know my nigga. Depending shit, on uh, how right, far man. that rad, uh, you need to go. The funny thing is, Uber said that um, they're hiring real pilots. <laughs> they, they better. Hopefully that's even a fact from the get go. I didn't know. I didn't, I didn't know this was going to be. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, I didn't know the debate was to get real, to get real uh, pilots or not. I didn't know that was part of the fucking debate, my nigga. Yeah, you know, have a lot of GTA flying into mountain type of ordeal. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I just wonder how much that shit gonna cost. Like, where the fuck are we landing? Where the fuck are we going? Where the fuck am I meeting you at? Um, nigga. And if is this a, like the ride share? Like, are we are we pulling? Are you pulling? Are, are, are we pulling this right now? <laughs> <laughs> like, my nigga, you gotta have this, right? Like, <laughs> oh, 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 now that you mention that the whole pooling thing, that's kind of that'll probably be dirty for the pilots, cause I know I know it's real dirty for the uh, people that uh, the, right. for the drivers. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. They, they get so fucked over on that. Yeah, I know but, I used to do, but I ain't never do no pool. That shit was dead. <sighs> Man. That shit used to be dead as fuck, my nigga. If you ain't a single rider, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> that shit is dead as fuck. Don't call my phone for the motherfucking wild ride. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, so that shit happened. Uh, I'm just waiting to warn the crash. Cause it's gonna fucking happen. Yeah. Like, that's wild. Like, I don't even know how many of the motherfucking, like, seats is in the fucking helicopter, my nigga, but I yeah. know for a fact, like, so All I know like, is, I would want somebody <laughs> that has hella, like, Experience. My nigga, how? Like, like, I don't want nobody straight off of like. You know, so getting buddy, I was just thinking about this funny fucked up. What if you give a nigga like one star while you still in the helicopter? Yeah, I want to push your ass out. Ain't no giving no tip. 
Uh, all right, I made it to our destination. Uh, can you rate my? Can you rate my? Can we trade spirits? Well, one star. All right, we're back in the air one more time. <laughs> Just push him back. <laughs> or do uh, do <laughs> I do that bullshit with doo doo when we be playing the game and his ass be driving the helicopter? Like, oh, <laughs> Just jump out that bitch. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think we at our destination. He drop. He be first one out. <laughs> we still in the chopper and shit. Oh uh, yeah, that shit funny. Oh yeah, that shit happening. Uh, so if y'all want that Uber drive or that Uber fly ride, whatever the fuck is even gonna be called, uh, Uber flight. Get ready to spend that money. <laughs> that's gonna that's gonna cost a grip, like for a fact though. Uh, Malcolm, I said it. maybe you can contest this. I wouldn't fucking know. Uh, um, there's a new study saying that Netflix is killing couples' sex life lives. So. <laughs> Does that mean Netflix and chill is no longer a term of this generation? <laughs> That's funny. It's, no probably, wonder. it's probably. It says couples too, so I don't know. It says couples, yeah. killing couples, sex slides. Yeah, so it's saying couples. It's probably because motherfuckers are uh, sitting there binging shows. But nigga, I ain't well, people still sex. on Netflix. Every time I have sex, on Netflix is on my nigga. I'm pretty sure it's binge by itself. Yeah. I'm doing whatever the fuck I'm doing in the background. <laughs> <laughs> right. It ain't like you can't watch, watch something on there. So, yeah, so that's the new study that Netflix is killing the sex lives of couples and shit. I don't know what couples these are, but obviously. Mm-hmm. Uh, Netflix has control over their relationship. And that's For real. a good ass show on. <laughs> I was, I had to look, take a second look at those. I want to watch those. Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say I want to watch whatever the hell that person was watching. Yeah, so shit. So that's I wonder how that fucking study even goes on, my nigga. Like, like do you just research people like when they come home and they turn on that face and they don't fall? Like, yeah. is that the research? Like, I don't feel like fucking. That. That's just watch those on Netflix. Like what? I think that's a regular day. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> that Netflix ball. <laughs> Niggas don't get ass all the time, B. <laughs> it's like, man, I'm, pretty sure, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure it was. Uh, uh, they probably wasn't fucking. If. No, uh, no every time I want to have sex with my wife, either. doesn't my nigga. I don't play that shit with Netflix, nigga. Right. <laughs> what the fuck? That's weird as fuck. That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> That's just weird. Like, how the fuck do you. How the fuck do they even do that research? Oh, hold on, what the fuck is this? Like? Uh, it's like a study by researchers uh, at Lancaster University in the UK reveals this is the UK do they even fuck like that in the UK I don't know it's not US I don't fucking know uh, basically the hours of the internet uses between 10pm and 11pm driven by those watching extreme services such as Netflix yeah, I play on YouTube I think I'm sleep at 10 o'clock I'm trying to go sleep at least I'm trying oh <laughs> well, yeah no I ain't gonna lie to you uh, sometimes depending on what kind of show it is so I, I stay up to like past 10 to uh, finish binging it. Yeah, well, yeah, so that shit happened. I don't know. Like, <laughs> Netflix gonna strike that motherfucker. Yeah. Right? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I get turned down for my wife before I get turned down for Netflix. Like, <laughs> that's why I pay the bill. <laughs> because if it comes down to the point that Netflix is controlling my sex life, nigga, I just, I will stop paying the bill. <laughs> like, it's kind of that simple to cut off. It's yeah, cut the service off. Cut the service off. Oh, man. Yeah, so that's, what, that's, that's, that's that. <laughs> Uh, next, uh, next we play, uh, no, I'm not play, next we pays, uh, Starbucks $7.1 billion to sell its coffee. Hey, buying this, uh, coffee? <laughs> no, the, the brew, I don't know. Probably no. Yeah, packs. somebody's just a brew. Well, yeah, like, they really want that in at Starbucks for some fucking reason, though. Yeah. They paid Starbucks to sell their fucking coffee. Hey, you're trying to, yeah, they're trying to. That was kind of a, you know, I don't think it's the right time to be trying to get in business. Oh, you're talking about all right the uh, lawsuits and stuff? <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. So I don't think that's a good time. Oh, my nigga, did you, uh, I ain't put this in the fucking notes. What did this happen? This is happening at Duke University? Oh, I can't fucking remember. I think it was Duke. Uh, at a coffee shop. Mm-hmm. Uh, it was a black female and a white male. And they would play, do you know Young Dolph? You said, uh, what? Young Dolph. Do you know Young Dolph? No. He's a rapper. Okay. Well, it, 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 they was playing a song on the last week in the cafe. Get paid, y'all nigga, get paid. Get paid, y'all nigga, get paid. Uh, right, I just said a black woman and a, a white, black a white woman, male a white on Duke campus in a coffee shop. In a coffee shop. <laughs> so, uh, probably like a dean of admissions or something like that, like some higher up dude came into the fucking coffee shop and fired them. <laughs> 
And there was a big ass protest, and the protest got so hard, my nigga, that the students, a bunch of white students, by the way, because we're at Duke University, majority white, they bum brushed the man office with a fucking loudspeaker paying young off. Get paid, young nigga, get paid. And that was their protest. My nigga, could you imagine a bunch of white people walking through the halls of the school and to the Rihanna, office and shit? Bitch, you gotta have my money. It, that is too, yeah. But that's not as bad as. Get paid, young nigga. nigga. The shit ain't bleeped yeah. out. Yeah. <laughs> the shit not bleeped out. So they ain't really walking through the, 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 the hall or whatever the case is. With the young dog saying, get paid, young nigga, get paid. <laughs> nigga, that shit was hilarious. Uh, also, uh, I don't know if you know, but um, Rolling Loud is happening this weekend or it's happening or it's in the process of happening right now. Mm. Uh, young dog performed. And he flew out the two students. Okay. And he put them on stage and he gave them twenty thousand dollars each. Until wow. they found another job or whatever well, the case is, they plan on doing what they like, but uh twenty thousand dollars my nigga. Boogie to tuition, I'm out this bitch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm taking whatever the fuck I own to the motherfucking nuke and the rest of it's time to start a business. <laughs> like, yeah, fuck that shit. Uh, I'm done. Also, it's some rapper news, Melvin. Uh, I, I just had this, this. I just saw this this morning. I don't know if it's real or fake or for the kids is, but uh, you know Young Thug, right? Yeah. Uh, you know Lil Uzi Vert? Uh, yes, sadly I do. They are known to be dating now. Also, Uzi Vert is finally finally came all the way out. I the don't know, my nigga. I just seen it on the news thing on the news feed, my nigga. And I was like, eh, first openly gay rap couple. Oh, we was the ones that paid the way for all the gay ass <laughs> rappers out there. Yeah, it was us. Yeah, so, <laughs> that shit happened. I don't know if that shit true or not, but uh, let me take a weird ass pictures and. I mean, it's probably not like true, or it's probably is yeah, true. Can I'll I show know. you the picture though? That's that made this uh, sure. Yeah, that's possible. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. So yeah, from that picture alone, they said that they're dating now. Okay. Yeah. But yeah. it's from the MTO News. Um, I don't even know. The most visited African American news network. All right, let's not have to go to MTO again. If that's what the fuck it stands for. <laughs> the most visited African American news network. <laughs> I've never seen that. I believe the fifth. Uh, yeah. So yeah, that's uh, some shit that happened, I guess. Uh, let's see what the fuck this is. I don't know what the fuck this is. Don't play anything. Oh, I don't know what the fuck this is. Oh, Ken Jong. Um, you know who that is, right? Ken Jong. Ken Jong. Uh, the motherfucker. What the? What the right. fuck? Hangover. Yeah. Hangover guy. Oh. Hangover guy. I can't think. I I can't think what else he played. I think that's him, right? Kim Jong. I think that's his fucking name. Uh, I thought you were talking about Kim Jong. No, 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 no. no, no. <laughs> I, was, I was like, what? I was like, what? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hangover guy. Oh, the hangover. Uh, uh, hangover. Oh yeah, yeah. Mister Wu or something like that. I can't remember. I ain't seen Hangover in a long fucking time. Yeah. It was like Wu or something like that. I can't fucking remember. But uh, he saved somebody's life during one of his stand-ups. You know, he's a real doctor. Yeah. Um, I want to say he got his, like a. What is this? No, uh, he got, got all his shit. Sitcom, doctor, what show kind of. Yeah, that was him. I think he got canceled now. Oh, speaking of cancellations, my nigga, did you see the Fox cancellation list, my nigga? No, no, I did not. Holy shit. They dropped everything. Brooklyn Nine-Nine, Lucifer. Yeah, I saw Lucifer. Uh, and the fucked up thing about Lucifer, my nigga, like, I think they found out the day before. Before? Like, he was supposed to premiere or some shit like that or some oh, shit like that. man. Yeah, but luckily for Brooklyn Nine-Nine, though, they got picked up by NBC, like, the, the next day. And my nigga, that's a good ass show. I used to watch this and I just fell off that shit. Mm. But uh, they got picked up by NBC as soon as they got dropped like the next fucking day. But uh, yeah, so that shit happened. So Ken Jones saved the life. Do this stand up. He is a real fucking doctor. Like he had a PhD and every fucking thing. Like all that shit. So, that's cool. Uh, so he saved someone doing stand up. Were they choking or something? Or a heart attack? Chicken balls in the uh, comedy club. I don't know. Probably not, <laughs> probably not that good. Uh, oh, this should be fun. Uh, Black Panther 2, release date, cast, rumors, and theories. <laughs> if anybody's seen Infinity War, that shouldn't be a Black Panther 2, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that, that, 
was already it was yeah, already yeah, announced. Yeah, yeah. It was already announced before we even seen. Of course, Infinity but still, Wars. a lot of people that was mad at Infinity War. Yeah, Black Panther too. There's no Black Panther. Huh? Yeah, yeah. yeah, fuck out of here. <laughs> fuck out of here. Top Ghost of Black movie. You don't get a. You don't get a sequel. <laughs> As yeah, a, right. Those, 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 those non-comic book people. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. yeah, uh, it, it's just funny when you like read stuff on social media, and I'm, I'm like had like the big old smirk grin, like motherfucker. You only knew. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you over here pouting about you know this person and this person. Oh, um, people dying and shit. But, uh, yeah, so it's set, uh, for, uh, 2020, uh, it's saying 2020 seems like a reach. Oh, uh, so it's saying, um, uh, February 18th, 2022. Mm. Exit's crime. It'd be alright. Yeah, you won't let down, don't let down. Yeah. Yeah, okay. no weapon. Okay, no. Um, so yeah, February 18th, 2022. Shit, that seems long as fuck. It doesn't even seem long. Twenty two. Twenty two. I mean, we are in eighteen. 18. That's four years. Hey, fuck. one of those. Uh, What's that? One of those years. What is it? Nineteen. Uh, yeah. Uh, Game of Thrones. And then before you know it, we had this movie. Yeah. <laughs> the Game of Thrones gonna be trash though. It's gonna hit. <laughs> said it's gonna be trash because it's ended. Yeah. I mean, you can't, you can't let shit run on. Oh, Whatever. Yeah. Simpsons been known for fucking. Like, mean, <laughs> That's the Simpsons. Thirty plus years. Probably. That's the Simpsons. Though. <laughs> it's, I mean, this came from a book. Yeah. You know. <laughs> Everybody dies, B. Yeah. <laughs> the dragons are the last man standing. <laughs> <laughs> uh. So yeah, all that shit happened. Um. Speaking of weights, since we talking about weights. Uh, all you people can stop um, oh my and God. rejoice. The Sasquatch sauce is back. Yeah, <laughs> it's back with a vengeance. <laughs> yeah, they got a uh, renewed 70, 70, 70 episodes. episodes so got. that's probably like Damn. two, two seasons, two, maybe three. <sighs> Give or take. The wait is over. All the debating. And yeah. All so Rick and shit. Morty. Rick and Morty's yeah, back. Yeah, the Sasquatch sauce. Even it takes. Two years, two more seasons, Morty. Two more seasons, Morty. I'll get it. <laughs> two, three more seasons. <laughs> so yeah, so yeah, that shit is happening. So yeah, that, that was uh, dope. I thought uh, the seventy episode. Yeah, I don't know why that seems like so much to me, but I'm assuming just because it's like Rick and Morty. Because I want to say they probably have uh, like seventy episodes out right about now, yeah, about or maybe now, like yeah. a little less. But just to hear like that shit, like like in abundance, I guess, like. Yeah, Rick and Morty, 70, 70 more episodes. Yeah, like, same. Hey, it sounds like a lot. <laughs> like, but... that, like, like, my nigga, uh, the way they made it seem, like, I didn't read the article or something like that, my nigga. I was like, damn, they put all that 70 episodes in one season. What the fuck? Oh, no. <laughs> like, what type of crack that one motherfucker to be on with Rick no, and Morty? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> they, gonna, they gonna split them up into seasons, man. It'll yeah. probably be like two, we'll probably get two seasons or three, depending on um, how many a season we get, how many episodes a season we get. But yeah, rejoice, people, rejoice. Yeah. So, uh, so Rick and Morty is coming back. Uh, those one still correct? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Don't tweet. Alright. Cool. Uh, so next we got uh, excuse me, uh, Robin Williams bio revelations, uh, infidelity, substance abuse, and insecurity over Jim Carrey. That's interesting. Yeah. And now like I read. See that. And now I read that. I see a lot of Jim Carrey and Robin Williams. You see a lot of Jim Carrey and Robin yeah, Williams. Yeah, just like the like the playfulness and like the like the wackiness, like they they character type shit. Yeah, both. I mean, both of these guys are really great yeah, at what they do. Yeah, definitely, definitely. definitely. So, so yeah. Uh, uh, I see a lot of. I, I don't know. I, I have to read that shit. He kind of. I, I want I wonder what the uh, what's the insecurity about uh, with yeah. the shit. Is. So yeah, so uh, yeah. I mean, they both started on different like, oh, uh, platforms and shit. The fuck did we end up back on MTO? Oh. Uh, <laughs> I don't care about this. I don't care about fucking woman being shot on fucking live stream. I don't care oh, about oh, that. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> don't, my nigga. Don't live stream, my nigga. They shoot me. The fuck? Hey. <laughs> I got to document this. Yeah. Um. Dancing college grads drag off stage. School apologizes for being inappropriately aggressive. 
<laughs> I think, yeah, I've seen that. It was like a couple of them getting dragged off like that. Oh. They didn't even really drag them off. Like, I, the, the headline makes it seem like they knocked their ass on the ass and just dragged them off the like, uh, Yeah, like, came like, in like, style. Yeah. <laughs> It just kind of shoved them out the way a little bit. Like, when they, we got, this is a big ass school, we got a lot of students, they can get the fuck off the stage, man. Get, right. Move the shit along, bro. Like, all right, <laughs> like, all right. All right, you, all right got, you, got not, and, you got two shakes and a twist. All right, you gotta go. And I'm assuming just because they're all black, they were like the black students. I'm yeah. assuming they're saying that this is racist or some shit. I don't know. My nigga, but uh, this is a big ass class, you niggas. Uh, move the shit around, my nigga. Even if I was in the crowd, in the stands, sitting. Where these niggas just came from, uh, my nigga. Hurry up, let me get my diploma and get the fuck off. <laughs> I've been trapped in this school too motherfucking long already as it is. Like y'all dance, this shit making the show. Get the fuck like, off, look, it's bad enough as soon as I cross the stage and collect this paper. The collection's <laughs> gonna be right <laughs> at the door. <laughs> right, my nigga. Like, get the fuck off, man. Move this shit around, bro. But uh, yeah, so I, I, I hate that. I just hate reading that fucking story. They claim that to be racism because they was black and shit. And they was dancing on stage. Nah, nigga, move the fuck around. The fuck off the stage. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't that, my nigga. Just get the fuck off the stage. Uh, filmmaker killed by giraffe while working in South Africa. Uh, giraffe? Yes. Sorry, savage is like that, bro? Hey, man. <laughs> Any animal can be a uh, straight up savage if you provoke it. Ain't no, no giraffe, no, my nigga. This nigga got his face close to a fucking. Oh, I guess that's a cheetah? That's probably Photoshop, but still, though. Yeah. Yeah, man, you gotta be. Yeah, you had to do something wrong to like to get killed by a giraffe, bro. Man, giraffe. Right, <laughs> hey, man. Depending yeah, on what killed, season it is. You got killed by a herb before, my nigga? You seen giraffe spike? <laughs> nigga, that's like getting beat up by a vegan. It's have not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever seen giraffe spike, man? I know they use their necks and yeah, they fucking, yeah, yeah. uh, they, they kick. And they kick. My nigga, that had to be the hardest headbutt in life for you to die from that shit, bro. Yeah. <laughs> that had to hurt. That was a hard ass headbutt. Yeah. <laughs> like a slant, like a, Either like a that or he, or he fucking, I forgot what the fuck they call it, but he kicked back or whatever the case is, like donkeys and, and horses and shit do, I guess. Yeah, and he's tall as hell, so I mean, either that he probably got trampled or something. Yeah, I would've put that nigga in the head like, bro. This <laughs> rap got me fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you get up all the way up there and try to put your rap in the head like. But yeah, that shit happened, man. Damn, yeah. bro. Yeah, you get killed by a fucking rap, bro. <sighs> Two hand game together, bro. Hey man, there's a lot of shit. There's a lot of shit in Africa that can kill you. You're supposed to grab the whistle or something, nigga. There's a lot of shit in Africa that can kill you, bro. Nigga, life learned to draft and shit. Fuck out of here. Uh, what the fuck? Uh, Brad, whose arm was bitten off by a crocodile, gets married days after attack. <laughs> Ooh, this deposit ain't going to waste no time, so money. <laughs> hey, this shit paid for. He was throwing up arm and no arm. Arm and no arm. <laughs> that shit, that's right. Oh, that shit. Expensive, she, did she get her whole, oh shit. She already got her whole arm bit off though. Yeah. And she black, so this ain't a white thing. It says that not a white thing, that's hmm. funny. Uh, this happened in Zimbabwe. Oh, in Africa. Huh? Yeah. Hmm. God damn. She really hey, got man, her whole I, arm bit off I, though. Shit, I fell on that, man. That is expensive, bro. Yeah, yeah she wouldn't she wouldn't miss this. I wouldn't miss it either, <laughs> shit. But all right, I'm missing that. All right, uh, we can deal with that shit later. Let's, uh, oh, real? let's walk down this aisle. We paid too much money. You got the white can, the matching dress? Lit. I know they probably have to do some last minute alterations though to like dress up. Cause like, oh. It, it looks kind of tight, I guess. I don't know. Oh, no, yeah, because one of the yeah, things going on by the shoulder, yeah. Yeah, because the straps, because yeah, like... Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's wild, though. Hey. How the fuck, why the fuck is my Premiere Pro open there? What the fuck? I didn't even click this shit. <laughs> Fucking stupid ass shit. Uh... Oh! Make sure stuff is recording still. It's recording still. You good. Um, Malcolm. What's up? Do you care about Jordan Peele's new follow-up movie to get out? being called us us at the top it's just us nigga excuse me uh were you a big fan of get out yeah, yeah i like get out you did okay mm -hmm. no, i didn't i got it you didn't I, like it i didn't like it but i got it i got the whole premise, oh, of, it. premise of it yeah we were trying to do and shit but i did it wasn't like one of my oh my god everybody go see get out <laughs> they were switching white people minds to black people minds <laughs> taking over bodies it was a straight alien movie. 
Low key, just with white people and black people. <laughs> a lot of brainwashing. Flashing the cameras and shit. <laughs> I got it though. I mean, it wasn't. It was alright. I guess I don't know. Uh, yeah, it was okay. Yeah. yeah, so the next movie is called Us, March 2019. It's supposed to, but I don't even know what the fuck's supposed 2019? to be. Yes, sir. That's, yeah, that's yeah, supposed, not that far away. Yes, sir. So, yeah. Uh, hmm. We'll see what that's about when the trailer drops. We'll be watching that. Hey. So, hopefully, it's better than Get Out, I guess, to me. <laughs> um, what else we got? Oh, Malcolm. Another movie news. Bill and Ted. They coming back. Yeah. You don't know about Bill and Ted? Keanu Reeves, like his first, like one of his first fucking movies, and they tried oh, to yeah, yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> like this nigga don't know about Bill and Ted. So yeah, it's a uh, confirmed. It's a. Uh, why did they? All right, I'm not interested anymore. They called this shit a threequel. I'm good. A prequel. A threequel. A threequel. It's the third. It's third the third the installment tower. of the movie. Yeah, you just lost my interest right there. All right. And that was corny as shit. Mm, 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 mm. Uh, next story. Because Keanu Reeves and them just fucked that up for me. Uh, photographer. Stranger Things use my storm cloud without permission. Get paid? Young nigga, get paid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. Uh, I thought... I didn't, I'm assuming this is from season two. Because the one cloud that I thought it was, I thought it was the one from the season one. Season one? Yeah, yeah so this is probably the storm cloud look from season two, I'm assuming. Well, probably the upcoming season, I'm not sure. But, uh, yeah, so Stranger Things out here. Doing what Copy big art. Hollywood production companies do. Still. And I'm assuming the uh, the person is gonna get compensated some way somehow. Yeah, they're probably they're suing are. And that they're suing and shit. So we'll see. But yeah, it's fucked up. Yeah, it looks like they're damn near identical. Yeah. Malcolm, mm-hmm. the robots are coming, motherfucker. They are coming. Oh man, speaking of the robots, let's crack it back. Uh, you remember the. Uh, the dogs that we saw. Yeah, it was, um, I saw a story about that shit, but I didn't ever look at it. What's up with that? Yeah, yeah, man, they finna go on sale. So I can get an electronic dog. Yeah. I want it. I was like, I was like, who the fuck would want one of those? I was yeah. like, why would you? And I'm taking it for walks. Yeah, he takes it for walks. <laughs> That's right. Like, Let somebody say something. You and your dog can stay the fuck away from you. Uh, and me, you and your dog robotic dog can stay the fuck away from First motherfucker that say something down the street. Taser, taser, taser. <laughs> <laughs> Go get his ass. Yeah, I was like, ah, I'm good. I was like, I don't need that thing turning on me. I'm good. Turn like that little dog from uh, Rick and Morty. Yeah. <laughs> Keep evolving this shit. <laughs> <laughs> my name is no longer Buttercup. <laughs> That's my slave name. <laughs> Snowball is my yeah, slave Snowball. Name. <laughs> Yeah. Oh yeah, so that should happen. Uh, but uh, with the robots and shit, um, there's a twenty-five thousand dollar robotic arm that uh, Starbucks barista is putting Starbucks barista out of business. Damn. Yeah. So uh, yeah, man, t- I've been telling them. Flippy like, out here. From we got uh, we got the flippy robot that flipping that's flipping burgers, flipping and, and, burgers and cooking. And, and now stuff. we got uh, yeah. I guess the name of this one is Cafe X. Motherfucker can run a whole cafe, cafe by itself. By itself. <laughs> Like you gotta don't need you motherfuckers no more. <laughs> but the thing is, the motherfucker got twenty five thousand dollars too at the same motherfucking time. Man. So I don't know how many motherfucking other things they're gonna put somewhere, but uh shit, twenty five thousand dollars is a lot though. That's a lot. They they probably gonna have like a few of those. They well they probably gonna test them out, see how well they yeah, yeah. do and stuff, but yeah, so I don't know, man. They are saying that this robot that makes the coffee buy stuff is gonna be putting the Starbucks out of business. I doubt it though, because people go to Starbucks for the experience. Mm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, the last piece. See what happened the last couple of people that uh, tried to go there for the uh, experience. Hurry up and buy experience. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like, it's like, I don't think you buy nothing. Alright. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, so yeah, that shit happened. Um, oh, Malcolm. I don't know if I'm right or if I'm wrong, but Joan. 12th to the 14th? Mm-hmm. E3, brother. 
Get ready. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. E3. Yeah. Get ready, motherfuckers. I've been avoiding all the leaks and shit that been coming out and shit been blowing the fuck out of me. Oh, uh, yeah. I've been avoiding the shit out of them. Uh, watching all those videos and shit, so yeah. Talking about for E3? Yeah, because I don't want to get like to E3. You want to see all the games, man. I don't want to get shit blown up for me and shit don't happen and shit like that. I'm good. Just, I just wait. I just wait. Uh, Final Fantasy and Kingdom Hearts writer. I'm not even going to attempt that fucking name. It's working <laughs> on Lupin the Third, Part 5. Woo! So I'm assuming it's going to be a movie. Lupin! Oh, they actually have a trailer for this already. Hmm. Let's keep that page cool. open. We can watch that a little bit later. Yeah. Um, so yeah, so that's happening. Uh, what else? Uh, title accused of mass massively inflating Beyonce and Kanye streaming numbers. Issues strong denial. So, people are lying about the numbers that, uh, that, that they're making on records that. are coming and shit like that. I, um, I can't kind of see that. Yeah, I mean, who cares? Are we still counting record sales in 2018? Like, do we care about that type of shit? I, I guess if you're a business. Are people even making money off music anymore? Like, are you making money like strictly off music? Please point me to the person that makes money strictly, strictly off, off music. music. No. Right. <laughs> you got other avenues. You got merchandise. You got uh, not unless you clamping uh, music and like tours nigga, together. Nigga, nigga, come like here, those come here, had like one CD, my nigga. That nigga is a billionaire off technology, my nigga. <laughs> I know for a fact no one cares about fucking music and inflating fucking numbers, my nigga. <laughs> Fuck that shit. Um, uh, we talked about the Uber joint already. Oh, that's gonna Dollar happen. We have to watch care. that. <laughs> I thought this was funny, but I forgot to read this. Yeah. Uh, this is probably for you, Malcolm. Uh, an ode to Kratos' nipples. People talking about Kratos' nipples. Yeah, I forgot to read this shit, but it's like a lot of zoom in pictures of his Ooh. nipples. <laughs> just his one nipple, I guess, that shows throughout the whole game. <laughs> I'm finna fuck knock him whole head up because now he's gonna be focused on that one nipple every time he plays God of War. I ain't gonna be too fucked up because uh, I'm, I'm, I'm it's only on. one nipple though. Like it's really only one nipple. It's yeah. on the same fucking slab. I think it's, it's um, like a whole bunch of zoom in pictures of different angles of this nigga nipple. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. It's just a one nipple show. Shit, I don't know why that's even a thing or why people are like focusing on Kratos' one nipple. Yeah, shit. I'm trying to assume they, they're trying to assume that he doesn't have another nipple, I guess. I don't fucking <laughs> know. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's I'm right. gonna, and, and I ain't going to be even concerned with the nipple because I'm, I'm more concerned with getting my ass whooped by that ninth Valkyrie oh, and shit. Man. That's funny, though. Oh, man. So it's nipple made headline. <laughs> it's nipple made headline. <laughs> <laughs> Fortnite. <laughs> Uh, they put Thanos in Fortnite. Yeah. I didn't. I I want to well, look at people uh, do it. Or I guess it's skin or something. Skin like that. or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't know. It, it's weird that they're even doing that. But I mean, it just just shows that Fortnite is like still a threat to be reckoned. I'm assuming. So yeah, I don't know. I think people are like killing Thanos or some shit like that. You have to like. Fight it's probably some, some kind of event or something. Yeah, um, something like that. I'm not sure. That they had before. Well, yeah. Just don't let them extend the swings. I guess. It's just snap his fingers is over. Yeah. Ooh, you know what would be really fucked up What's for right? Fortnite what? people? If, if he snapped his fingers and maybe like all these stats or some shit disappeared. Oh, that would suck. Ooh, man, that would suck. That would, be, that would piss <laughs> like, me off. You, you remember how we saw Ready Player uh, Ready Player One? Yeah, one. they lose and the uh, new world and all this shit. Goes yeah, they lose, right? yeah, and they lose everything yeah, and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that would be so fucked up. You know, there's some games that's out there that's like that though, but I I, I, I ain't got to, I would never play I them. I rage too much. <laughs> I get pissed off at games you ain't even supposed to rage at, my nigga. If right. my shit gets taken away every time I die or lose, my nigga, I'm Ooh. gonna lose my fucking mind. Uh, really? So yeah. Malcolm, there's a new scam on the forefront that I think I'm actually a victim of this shit. Uh, work from home scams target online job seekers. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So I've been applying for a lot of jobs like I've been saying. I think we both we probably been applying yeah. for a lot of jobs shit too. I get random ass calls talking about book a trip and all this other shit. Book a trip. Yeah, like all type of numbers and shit be calling my fucking phone like throughout the fucking day. And I was trying to really realize like why the fuck do these people keep calling me? Because uh, they got your 
information. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm a victim to this. And I don't like it. <laughs> yeah. So that's what's happening. That's actually people's job, I guess. And some reason it's legitimate. That it's a work from home job. Uh, but yeah. It's like the new pyramid scheme. I don't even know what the fuck it is, my nigga. It's just weird. Like, I don't know. I don't know if they're selling you something, they're trying to sign you up for some shit, or what the fuck the case is. But yeah. Um, let's see. We got most dope stories, my mm-hmm. Avengers Infinity War. Directors reveal who died and survives off screen. Would you like to read this, my good man? This would be interesting. All right. Uh, so it's probably doing everybody, even, even the people we haven't seen on screen. Howard the Duck. Who oh, do we care about Howard the Duck? Why? He's safe. Okay, no one gives a fuck about Howard the fucking Duck. <laughs> the fuck type shit was that? That was fucked up. Uh, Jane Foster, Natalie Portman. Too spoilery. That's the status. <laughs> I don't. I don't even know what the fuck that means. Okay. <laughs> and my tell Actor Loki. Bad day. All right, this is some bullshit. All right, I thought I was. I was really getting into some shit. Nah, <laughs> I ain't gonna tell you nothing. Too spoilery, but probably still rocking. Shuri! Weirdly unknown. Oh, fuck you guys, you so brothers. Fucking Russo brothers. That's assholes. Um, yeah, Ned. Shit. Spider-Man's friends. Too, Too spoilery. spoilery. Oh, you guys are assholes. <laughs> Nakia. Unknown, but probably safe because we're kind of forever. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, the Russo brothers are assholes. Alright, yeah, so nothing we gotta explain. Uh, Malcolm. What's up? Welcome to Avengers again. Um, Avengers, man. I did, I don't know if you probably saw this, but did you see the last words that Groot said before he disappeared? Have you seen that? I am Groot. Yeah, but do you, they translated it though. They translated yeah. I am Groot. They asked they the Russo brothers, so they asked somebody and they, he said daddy. He said daddy. So oh, rocket. Oh. So now people are seeing like that uh, Root has a father son bond type to rocket. To rocket. Uh, to rocket. Yeah, that's funny. Yeah, so that happened. <laughs> uh, yeah, some, apparently somebody took a class to yeah, learn Groot. To learn Groot. <laughs> Fuck, you think you are Thor? Thor. He's like, oh, yeah, they offered a course. <laughs> yeah. Uh, something that might fuck up somebody's money uh, Benedict Cumberbatch. Mr. Strange, Dr. Strange, Dr. Strange. Uh, says he'll only take new projects if his female co-stars receive equal pay. That's kind of cool. Which is very noble. Yeah, that's, by the way. that's cool. I know. But, you might fuck up some of your pay. Might. Because, my nigga, you are in an Avengers movie. A couple of them, actually. Uh, it's going to be kind of hard to match your fucking salary, my nigga. Yeah. yeah. Not, 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 not even if it's a female. Not like, unless he's talking about... Fuck the female part. That's a whole other male... On the fucking cast yeah. to match your motherfucking salary. Not, not that you're probably asking for right now. Not unless he's speaking about um, he's talking anything about new afterwards. Projects. Yeah, yeah, he's talking about new projects. So, though, so I don't know. It could be anything from like um, once once he's done. But like I know my nigga's stock is rise. Like Mar- uh, but, Marvel Universe thing. Like I know my nigga's stock is rise. So it's gonna be kind of hard to like match your shit, bro. And of course, he doesn't say how much he makes in movies and shit. But yeah. oh yeah, it's uh, that's <laughs> not, like. I love him, oh, yeah. Sherlock, man. Oh, yeah. Sherlock, my shit. Um, uh, one of the last stories. Chicago exhibit uh, replicates bike sharing with AR-15s and gun protest art. Did you see this? No, I did not. It's pretty awesome. And they put it right in front of the... Is that the Daily Center? I want to say. Uh, I think the Daily Center. I'm not sure. Probably. There's a video, but I'm just going to let it play with it for the kisses. We don't have any sound right now. That's really neat sound. Oh, this isn't even a fucking video, I'm pretty sure. Come on, man, show the fucking picture. What the fuck? <laughs> Somebody's hungry. Yeah, let me eat. It's all good, though. Yeah, Daddy Plaza. Okay, yeah. yeah. So you can't see it in the video. They're going to play how the fuck I want to play. But you see, like, the... What the fuck is that shit called with the blue bikes? Oh, uh, the Dibby bikes. Dibby, yeah. So that's the new art that they put down in front of that other big ass art thing in front of the Daily Center. So they put down what gun? Like, it's a bike share bike. like thing, but instead yeah. of the bike that has the AR fifteens. Ah. And that was the art uh shit in front of the Daily Plaza and shit. Mm. So I don't know how long that's gonna stay there. Yeah. But that's interesting. Yeah. 
And the last story before we wrap this bitch up. Happy Mother's Day, motherfuckers. Andre 3000 releases two new songs for Mother's Day. Mm. That's the 3000. So, if you have been scratching feeling and going nuts for some Andre 3K. That's me. You got two new songs. The first song is called Me and My. Uh, parentheses uh, to bury your parents. I have no clue what that means. And the second song is "Look, Ma, No Hands." <laughs> All right, uh, I, I kind of want to listen to "Look, Ma, No Hands." Yeah, kind of. Listen to both of them. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna listen to both of them, brother. Yeah, but uh, yeah. Uh, oh shit! It says "Look, Ma, No Hands" is a 17 minute instrumental jazz cut. Uh, features under 2,000 on the bass and clarinet. And a cameo from James Blake on the piano. Mm. Cool. So is this just straight uh, music? With no raps? Or piece. what? Possibly. Not sure. You know how three thousand do. Yeah, yeah, ain't no telling. But yeah, so yeah, so two new songs under three K. If anybody's interested, which you should be, yes. should very well be actually. Uh, Malcolm. Yeah. Are we good here? Can we wrap this bitch up? Yeah, I think now we got his trailers. Trailers, trailers, trailers. Trailers. Alright. Let me just put these trailers up right fire. Hey, uh, we gotta watch that again. No, uh, not even gonna play. Okay. Uh, make sure we get all the motherfucking trailers. Come on, stupid. That's it. Alright, ready? Mm-hmm. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Then. It's been another episode of Dread Dad's Podcast. My name is Clint. My name is Mal. And make sure to follow all our social media networks, Dread Dad's Podcast, except for Twitter, two dads with, with dreads. dreads. And we out this bitch every single week. We have a podcast called Dread Dad's Podcast. Be there, motherfucker. You don't have to be a dad, you don't have to have dreads, motherfucker. So guess what? You can come with a bald fucking fade or a bald fucking head. We don't <laughs> fucking care. Enjoy yourself, bitches. Exactly. And we out this bitch. Deuces.